What about other types of neuropathy like diabetic neuropathy? Well, similar, we have a glucose issue that over years and years of out of control blood sugar, those capillary beds get destroyed. And as those capillary beds get destroyed, we can no longer oxygenate those tissues as well as we could before that damage. And so in the short term, we create hyperoxygenation, bring oxygen to those damaged nerves. And not immediately, but over the course of only a few weeks, we'll typically see some feeling return and some function return. But if we continue to support that person, we'll start to get new blood vessel growth and new capillary growth and healing of the capillary beds and the endothelial lining, the inside lining of our blood vessels. Over the long haul, we'll get neurogenesis, we'll get improved synapse connections, we'll get all that neuroplastic change that I'm talking about, as well as the growth factors and the stem cells migrating into areas for healing, repair, and regeneration of tissue.